Oh my God. Okay, so I saw this in the store, my bake supply store, Artisan Accents. They said that the colors were vibrant. This is red. This is only, I made up some, uh, you know, just uh, fake icing to put in. So the powdered sugar and shortening. So I didn't use butter or anything like that, just that. Just to see. Now I used the purple and the purple came out beautiful on a cake I did. So I said, well, I'm gonna go back and get the red and the black because those are the two hardest colors to make. And that was just like maybe one or two drops and just from the toothpick, you know, getting the little uh, styrofoam, well, not styrofoam, you know, a little top off. Gorgeous. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I can't wait to do the black. Okay, now I'm getting ready to add the black. The midnight black artisan accents. I'm shaking it up. And this is the fake icing. So I'm getting ready to add a couple drops. Oops, okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we're gonna stir it up. Okay, so the black still is a little gray. A little gray I don't know maybe we add just a little bit more see if we can get it black and two drops to it oh my goodness it's darkening up Darkening up, but it's still gray. It's still gray. Okay, so I add two more drops to it. Okay, it darkened up some. Let me turn the, the, the flash off. Okay, I don't know. Put the flash back on. Okay, it darkened it up. It's still gray. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to see about... Doing that little trick with putting it in the microwave for a few minutes to see if it darkens up. I'm just going to take half of this and I'm going to put it in the microwave. I put it in for, I'm putting it in for 10 seconds. See if it's going to darken up. Okay, so now it did. It did turn black, so I just have to wait for it to cool down before I add it to the other one. So man, I'm gonna say it's a yes on these um, on these artisan accents by sweet color lab coloring I'm about to throw all my other colors away because this right here this is the truth okay so I let it cool down a little bit in the freezer so I'm gonna take it out of here and mix it up And yes, 
it's, I mean, it's black. I mean, oh my goodness. This right here is life. And this is the red. Man, those are some gorgeous, gorgeous colors. Oh my goodness. So, whew, that artisan, that's life. That's life. I'm going to see if I can incorporate the picture of the cake that I did uh, with the purple. But, oh my God, the two hardest colors in the world, artisan accents. From Sweet Labs, what was it called? Sweet Color Lab. Man, they got that. They got that right. They got that right. Okay, so I wanted to do one more color. Um, this is Azure. Azure blue, two drops is all I added. Two little small drops. Look at that. Oh my God. That is just vibrant. I mean, I, I am, I, yeah, I'm throwing all these other colors away that I got from these other places. Maricola and all those. Can't touch this. Mm 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 mm. Mm -mm, mm -mm, can't touch this this is just oh my god this is just gorgeous just gorgeous Ooh. now this is the starter kit I got it off Amazon the bigger bottles that I had like this I just stuck that in there um, this one I got at the abuse at the bake supply store uh, two fluid ounces this one is one the ones that come in a little starter box is one uh, you get a dilution kit so you can use it you get a dilution solution so you can put it in your um, in your uh, Got your airbrush machine and it comes with how you supposed to use it and everything uh, I just love these oh my god I just love these and you get your primary colors and a couple secondary colors so you can just make all all the rainbow you can make all the colors oh I just love it 